Welcome to the lesson video on the bootstrap method. The bootstrap method is the process of taking repeated random samples with replacement of a data set and then estimating some parameter on each sample in order to get a better understanding of the variation and certainty in the estimate of that parameter. So for example, we have a scatter plot of data here and suppose we want to understand uh, our estimation of the slope of a regression line for this data. So what we can do is take a ra random sample, take four different random samples with replacement of this data, and then on each of those, we estimate a regression line, and then we look at the estimated slope of that regression line, B1 hat with a superscript of one, two, three, or four. Then we can look at the uh, standard deviation of these B subscript one superscript I hats, and that'll give us an estimate in the uncertainty of our estimate of the beta one or the slope of the regression line. This can be, this estimate in particular, the slope of the regression line, we have a standard error, which allows us to uh, estimate that without using bootstrap, but bootstrap method is uh, powerful to do that type of estimation uh, for things other than regression coefficients. And so here's the, uh, the general format with another toy data set. And so here we have a, a toy data set with three observations, labels one, two, three. And we have two features, an X feature and a Y feature. And this is figure 5.11 from the Isler textbook. And so this is our original data set shown in the box on the left called Z. And then we take a first subset, which is in this notation, Z1 or Z star with an exponent one. Um, and notice it has the random sample here is taken with replacement. So we have three and then we have another three um, in this random sample. And then we estimate some parameter alpha hat uh, and then with a superscript star one to say it's this is the alpha hat the estimate from the first data set. And then we take a second bootstrap random sample. And this one in this case happens to have one, two and three in it. And then we estimate alpha hat and with an exponent of star two to say this is from the second data set and we do this capital b times each time getting some random sample with replacement notice there's two twos in this in this sample and that gives us this sequence of estimates of alpha and then from that sequence of of uh, estimates of alpha we can understand the robustness or the uh, variation that can happen among the estimates of alpha Quick review, we've talked about the bootstrap method. It's an important statistical tool of taking uh, repeated random samples with replacement of our data and estimating a parameter on each of those samples to estimate uncertainty. Thank you very much.